What is up YouTube and welcome back to Bike Hub Japan. So on today's little adventure I'm going to take you for a tour around the city trying to find some interesting jihankis. Now what is a jihanki you might be asking yourself? Well I'll tell you. So the word itself is actually an abbreviation. The full word is jido hanbai ki. So jido means automatic, hanbai kind of like means sales and ki means machine. So basically it's an automatic selling machine. So what they call a jihanki, we in the West would just call a vending machine. Now you might think that's kind of a boring topic, but trust me, this is Japan. The land of the weird and wonderful. So, today we're going to go and visit a jihanki that sells cigarettes, ones that sell ice cold bottles of beer, one that sells toys, one that sells spicy chili sauce, and last but not least, I was just informed by my friend Adam that there is a vending machine by Nagoya Station that sells PlayStations. So we're going to go and try and find that one. But first, I have a little bit of a hangover today, so I want to go and visit a regular, a normal drinks machine and get myself a nice can of coffee to try and alleviate my headache. So without further ado, let's go and find a drinks machine. Ten seconds later. Right, that didn't take long to find one. So, little known fact, something that I read on the internet this morning, so it must be true. Um, there is apparently one drinks machine or one vending machine per, per 40 people of the population per capita. So, that means that right now there's 125 million people in Japan. So, with a little bit of calculation, I figure there's 3 million of these throughout the country. That's pretty amazing. But, like I said, I've got a bit of a hangover, so I need to get myself a nice black coffee so where's the old wallet where's the old wallet do i have a hundred yen oh, you poor as fuck there we go hundred yen put it in and a nice cold so the blue ones are cold uh and the red ones are hot so it's not really winter here yet so mostly they're um they're cold still actually quite funny because they change seasonally as well so in the summer everything is obviously cold but when it comes to the winter most of them are big, uh, uh, will change to hot and they've got interesting things like corn soup and different kinds of soups and hot coffees and all sorts so yeah they are kind of interesting i think all right let's uh sit in the old park over there have a smoke and a coffee and then get on our jihanki adventure this video is in no way sponsored by Georgia Deep Black Coffee, but here's an epic video of a Georgia Deep Black Coffee can, just for shits and giggles. Right then, let's get on with it. First stop, alcohol vending machine. <laughs> Alright, so the next jihanki we're going to find now is a jihanki that sells ice cold bottles of beer. Um, so yeah, so a vending machine that sells beer or alcohol is quite commonplace over here it's not unusual but what's what's different about this one is it sells big bottles like bottles like this size of beer and it says that they're ice cold so quite interesting so according to my map that is speaking to me via my intercom right now it's on the right side in 200 meters so let's keep our eyes peeled where are you no nope, that's the regular one you have arrived. I've arrived apparently. Where is it? Where is it? Ah, maybe that's it there. Aha! I have found it. Does oh need to do a Yui. Need to do a Yui. Yui and then fuck it, just ride on the pavement. Why not? Okay, here it is, here it is. Very cool. So here we have a alcohol slash beer vending machine. Uh, this one, that's actually really cheap. 290 yen for a bottle. That's not bad at all. 
considering a can is 208, 220. So what have we got here anyway? So Asahi beer, my favorite beer, super dry this one. So the 500 mil and the 350 mil. Then here we've got like kiwi fruit with alcohol in it, 4% alcohol and lemon. This one, can't read the Vicanzi on this one. But it's the same picture, so I guess that's lemon as well. Then here, Nika. You have to be careful when you say that out loud. So this is highball. So it's basically whiskey and soda. That's what I like as well. But that was a strong one, 9% alcohol. So probably four of those and you'll be away with the fairies. And then this one is zero. So this one is, it says pudding, 0%. And then alcohol, 0%. And calories, 0%. So that one's a, a no, non-alcoholic beer. And then this one again, we've got the, this one, I guess you would call this too high. So this one is uh, grapefruits and this one's lemon. And these, these ones are strong too, 9%. And the bottles at the bottom, they're just regular Asahi Super Dry. So yeah, there you have it. An alcohol vending machine. So what's next? All right, so my mate Adam told me about this uh, jihanki that he went to last night when he was drunk and uh, put a thousand yen in it for like a chance to win a PlayStation. But he ended up with some stupid sunglasses that he gave away to the guy next to him at the table <laughs> in, in an izakaya. So he told me where it was and I've been riding around in circles for about five minutes trying to find it. Only when I got off the bike and walked did I find it because there was a, tr a delivery truck parked in front of it blocking it. So it's just on the next corner. So let's have a look and see what it's got. This is the fish market area. So yeah, this beer truck was blocking it. Still is blocking it. Shall I wait for him to go? Or just have a look? Shh. いいよ、あとでこれちょっと写真撮りたいだけ。え、え、いいよ。もうすぐ。ああ、すいません。ごめんね。オタクのビデオ作ってるから。All <笑> right, so I asked the guy to move the truck, which he is doing. Very nice of him. <笑> So yeah, this was the one that Adam did last night. So it's a thousand, thousand yen. And then whatever is on here, you can win, but you don't know what you're going to get. So he said PlayStation, but I guess he meant Nintendo. He was drunk, so we'll forgive him. So I think what he actually won was those glasses which he gave away to someone because they were shit. So yeah, that's another one of the weird and wonderful ones. It's called King's Treasure Box. Oh, quite interesting. You can win a drone, a watch, a pair of binoculars. I think that's a dildo. An electric razor, a video camera, a Nintendo. Oh, maybe, oh, he's right, PS4. Didn't see that one hiding there. So yeah, for a thousand yen, you get a chance to win something amazing. But uh, I guess, you have to be really lucky to win one of those. Right, that's enough of that, onwards. Right, so the next Jihanki is a toy Jihanki. Now I know this one because this is the way that I take my daughter to the pool and every time we drive past it, she asks me to stop and I never do because I'm a tight ass mofo. So it's just up here somewhere on the left. Huh? Is that it? Oh yeah, there we go. Bus stop. Better, better pull up here. So let's have a quick look at this one then. So what do we got? Normal drinks machines. Normal drinks machines. Ah, no way. It's changed. It's exactly the same as the uh, Adams one. Gutted. It used to have like stuffed toys and animals. It's like ah. Okay, well this one's a bust. Back to the bike. 
So the toy G hanky was a bit of a bust. Sorry about that. It used to have like fluffy toys and stuff, cute little animals and stuff, but obviously they changed it to uh, the same as the one that Adam told me about. So uh, this way, anyway, is a cigarette vending machine. And the lady who runs the shop that it's outside of is uh, an old lady who's been running the same shop for about 30 years. And um, a couple of months ago, uh, a TV crew came to do uh, like a TV show about um, mom and pop stores, I think they called it. And uh, it just so happened that I was in the shop with my daughter buying sweets at the time. And so when the news, when the TV crew came in, I, I got interviewed and so I was on TV that day. And so I got so many messages from people that day saying, hey, I just saw you on TV. I thought they were gonna say crime watch, but no. Okay, so here's the vending machine. Now I actually know the lady quite well, so I'm gonna ask her if she'll open it up for us. Nanka tabako la mo saiki wa dame ni na na te ne. タバコは出来上がるの結構あるうんとすごいねうんもうほとんど売れないから少ししか入ってないええ売り切りやつは何何ほらもう売り切りじゃなくてもう入れてないああ種類が減らしてあるうんもうパスポートパスポート使うようにな
There's a couple more interesting jankies that I want to go and check out actually. There's one that sells fried edible insects, but it's kind of far away, so I'll save that for another trip when I'm heading out to the uh, Gifu area. So anyway, <laughs> not exactly much of a, of a motor vlog today, more just riding to various vending machines. But anyway, I hope you found it slightly interesting or amusing or, well, probably not. But if you did, make sure you hit the like button. And if you haven't done already, please do subscribe to my channel. Now I think the best way to cure my hangover is by having a beer. So I'm just going to go to get myself a nice refreshing can of beer. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.